Hi, Taurus. I am here to do your reading, you guys. Okay, Taurus. Okay, I was meditating up on your energy, trying to see where you're at. Okay, uh, remember, these are not personal readings. These are general readings, meaning general. I can only pick up on the strongest energy. Every Taurus is not on the same vibration. Okay, you guys. Yeah, while I was meditating, I was picking up on you're trying to move forward. You're trying to do something new in your life, okay? So the only problem is, is there's someone that wants to move forward with you, okay? And they are determined, okay? So yeah, I pulled out a couple cards just to see where it was at so I can get along and see exactly what's going to be going on with the cards, okay? Remember, Again, these are not personal readings. If you want a personal reading, all of the information is down below, okay? So, <clears throat> every Taurus is not on the same vibration, you guys, okay? Let me get out a message for you. I already lit some sage, okay? So, yeah, let me get a message out for you, Taurus. Oh, my goodness, you got the same message again. Okay, the devil is sitting right next to you, okay? So, yeah, so maybe the person that, that wants to move on with you, that wants to move along with you, um, this person is probably very toxic, and you probably already know it. So, from your last reading, the same message came out, okay? No joke, okay? But yeah, so Taurus... Let's see what's going on with your energy. Ooh. Archangel Michael, ancestors, please come in for Taurus. Give me three cards, please. What is the message that Taurus needs to hear at this time? Wow. Yes, you are. See? I told you, moving on. Yeah, they don't want you to move on, Taurus. And this is the number six. Six, six, six. Okay. So, yeah, there's somebody in your energy. You're moving on and you are determined to move on. There's someone in your energy that has it made up inside of their mind that you're not going to move on. This person could have had you in a third party situation. Spirit, come in. Give me two more cards for a Taurus. You're coming up as the boss, okay, Taurus? Authority figure, okay? You could be going to court. You could be dealing with the police, okay? Someone could be in jail. But this is my boss card. You might be seeing the number 444, okay? Authority. Again, please, for Taurus, one more card, please, Spirit. Archangel Michael, please come in for Taurus. Please come in for Taurus. Right. Okay, patience. Have patience in this situation, okay, Taurus? Um, this is the number 14. You could be seeing 111 or 444. Okay, so have patience. Um. Don't tell everybody your plans. That's what I'm feeling. And the person you're dealing with, if it's someone that you know is toxic, just tell them you're not moving, you're not doing this. I just canceled all of my plans. Be gone, okay? That's how you do it, okay? Put them in, put them in, put them in your back pocket, okay, Taurus? All right. Let's see what's going on with your energy for October. Archangel Michael. Please come in for Taurus. Please come in for Taurus. Pick up on Taurus energy. All right. Yeah. So, very loving energy here, okay? You could be dealing with the water sign, okay? But you're courting someone or someone wants to court you. Someone wants to be in your energy. Okay, you might be taking care of your kids, nurturing yourself. 
Yeah, that's the uh, Six of Cups. Also here you have the Queen of Pentacles, okay? Very generous. Um, this is security. You know how to manifest, okay? So you're studying on your Pentacles. You're being very nurturing to yourself, to your children, um, to this person too. You were probably very nurturing to someone that was very toxic, okay? And they know this. That's why they don't want you to move on, okay, Taurus? Uh, you could be dealing with the Sagittarius or a Capricorn energy here. Okay, we have earth and water on the board. One more card, please. What is Taurus energy? Please come through for Taurus. Wow, Taurus, yes, you are being nurturing to yourself. The Empress, this is your energy, the Jack of all trades, okay? Very fruitful, nurturing. You might be pregnant or to my fellas, you might be getting someone pregnant or have someone pregnant, okay? So you're working very hard. You're studying on your pinnacles. You're being very nurturing to um, the people that are very close to you, okay, Taurus? That's good. The person or situation that Taurus is dealing with. The person or situation. Okay, Taurus, we have the Two of Pentacles. The person you're dealing with has a lot on their plate. If you can see the waves in the back of this card, um, in their life, they go up and down. This person wants a cheerful reconnection with you, okay? So, yeah, this person has a lot of juggling going on, okay? So... One minute, this person is really high, and then they get really low, okay? So, yeah, this person probably have mood swings, okay? More, more earth energy. We have here at the bottom of the deck, the star card, okay? This person is trying to make a miracle happen with you, okay? This person could have other children. All right. Okay, so this person has the Eight of Cups here. Moving forward, this is probably my favorite card. When the going gets tough, you move forward in a mature way. So this person is trying to move forward in a mature way, leave back behind secrets and illusions. If this person was trying to pull the wool over your eyes in October here, this person wants to come out and this person wants to tell you the truth and nothing but the truth. But this person is moving forward with you, looking towards the sun, leaving illusions behind, any type of secrets behind. Yeah, you will know the truth here. This person has a lot on their plate. Once again, one more card. One more card, please, Spirit, for the person that Taurus is dealing with. One more card. Okay. Okay, so this person is probably going to be gone. Okay, this person here. Okay, this could be a good thing or a bad thing. The world card, okay? This person is amazing to you. This person is closing out a cycle. We will see what that is about. They're closing out a cycle, maybe on secrets and illusions or being an asshole from the outside looking in. If this person was juggling you, the Ten of Swords, pain in every way, okay? This person caused you a lot of pain, okay? Um, this person is moving on towards you, okay? They want to offer you a cup of love after all of this pain. One more card. Okay. The Ace of Pentacles, speedy success. Okay, this person is looking at you now in a very loving way. This person wants to be successful with you, okay, Taurus? Take this some shit. After the Ten of Swords, wow. Okay, what is the Six of Cups for Taurus? I 
Archangel Michael, what is the Six of Cups for Taurus? Oh, Taurus. King of Wands. Okay, so Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay. So here, you're becoming an entrepreneur. Uh, very talented. Talented, okay? You're very talented to teach others here, okay? You have a lot of talent. You nurture your talents, your gifts, okay? What is the Queen of Pentacles? Wow. The Three of Swords, okay? Third party situation. Okay, so now you're studying on your Pentacles after being in a third party situation. What is the Empress? What is the Empress, please, for Taurus? Okay, the Empress with the Seven of Wands here. Okay, achievements. You are closer to your goals. Okay, being very nurturing. So, yeah, you're getting closer to your goals. The person that you're dealing with here, what is the Two of Pentacles for Taurus? Wealth, okay. This person is juggling their finances, okay? This person wants you to teach them something about wealth or wants to come in and help you balance out everything. In a business situation, you could work with this person. But if not, this could have been a marriage here. Someone was backstabbed and betrayed. The Eight of Cups here. So the Eight of Cups, this person is moving forward, leaving secrets and illusions behind. They have the Knight of Chalices here, okay? This, this person is a friend and want to accept others as they are. This person wants to accept you as you are after a third party situation here, okay? This person knows that you don't you don't want to be in a third party situation. You're studying on your pinnacles. You're working really hard, okay? So now this person is like, okay, I put you through all of this or whatever it was, okay? It could go vice versa for the cross watchers, okay? Take the energy how it go. If it's not your story, please don't tell me it's not your story. Don't do it, okay? It's a energy reading. So listen. If you were put in a third party situation, okay, you're nurturing yourself very well, either or, cross watchers, whatever. So you're nurturing yourself very well from the lies and um, desperation, okay? You probably went, the hermit is at the bottom of the deck, could have been a Virgo. But anyways, this here is like leaving the situation alone. But this person wants to be your friend, okay, Taurus? The world card. Spirit, come in, please, for Taurus. Oh. What? Closing out a cycle to become the king of pentacles. Okay, Earth Energy, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus here. This person is closing out a cycle. Maybe closing out a cycle with you, okay? But this is an Earth sign. Closing out a cycle to be with you, okay? This person could have been a player here. We have the Knight of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Someone coming in and out of your life. Ten of Swords. Okay, so the Ten of Swords here. With the Four of Pentacles. Saving up after losing a job, after losing a lover. Okay, you're saving up for the appropriate time to get away from someone. Let's see what the Knight of Cups is. Okay, so this is probably known that this person has backstabbed or betrayed you or vice versa. 
okay? This person wants to come in and offer their love. This could be a Taurus man that wants to come into the Empress, which is Taurus energy. Someone wants to offer you a cup of love. The Knight of Cups with the Empress. Now they want to offer you a cup of love, okay? This person wants to be very nurturing to you. The Ace of Pentacles. This person could be showing you a lot of attention on social media or whatever now, okay? The Ace of Pentacles. What is the Ace of Pentacles here? All right, the Three of Wands. So you're preparing for to be an entrepreneur. You're probably isolating yourself here. Okay. Ace of Pentacles with the Three of Wands here. Speedy success. You're not rushing to win. Okay. You're taking your time. You're being very patient with yourself. Okay. Thank you so much, Torres. Bye, you guys.